I'm in me. Has she got a drone? <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, go away. <laughs> Has it taken her head off yet? <laughs> Whoops! Whoopsie! Oh. Why do I look so tiny? No. It's okay. Oh! 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 Listen, I know how to work a drone, right? That's doing my head in. That's doing my head in. That's doing my head in. Like, you're not meant to buzz it around your bedroom. What are you doing? Giving us a bird's eye view of halitosis and fucking germs. I know halitosis is a mouth disease, but you know. Cavity reveal. <laughs> 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 right i've dropped a treasure box to get your heart me's in your legends oh i've missed you lot it's like it's getting back into the driving seat right more buzz buzz oh that's me look ah! <laughs> that's quite scary and fun <laughs> <laughs> listen the first video i said if you go on my profile now quickly i stitched a video please come and watch it because that is the first fucking video i scrolled i was in bed i was you know really looking forward to my show really looking forward to having a chin wag with you lot and all that malarkey right first thing she's there in my uh, but i can't understand how the feeling in my soul and my body and my mind and all of that yeah how it made me feel Something happened. I got really angry. It went through me. It hurt. And my mental health took a nosedive. Uh, do you know what I mean? And I thought, I don't need to see that. It really fucking irritated me. And it doesn't normally. It, I can normally turn a blind eye and just like ignore stuff and pretend it ain't it. But it pissed me off. Do you know what I mean? Listen, if I've got to do it, you lot have got to do it. Mmm. Kelly Carr and Princess, thank you. I'll pick up everyone, thanks. Shepherd's Bush. Shepherd's Bush. So I'm in the queue to get a coffee. They, they all went down. Drama. Ariana Grande latte. I'm in the queue. She's in the queue. So I'm with my friends and... It's not... I'd so just I'm... like to say EQ would never be working minimum wage. <laughs> How dare you put her behind the counter? It should be me! Ticking Mation. Alphabet. That's not Alphabet, Alphabet, is it? With a one gift a badge. No, it's not. <laughs> My girl in front, she's ordered the mango juice. The woman has just got. The oh, Rubicon. Rubicon. Oh. And pulled it like this and just whacked on the lid and charged the girl six pounds. Rubicon. The eyes. It's like two for a pound in the pound shop. Six pounds. Thank you, Sabrina. Six pounds. Rubicon. <laughs> I've just seen the car in a Rubicon and I'm just, I said, get the fuck on out of here. You're chuck six quid. Could have bought a crate of it for that. Yeah, but you don't pay six pounds for that much. A drink from a carton for Rubicon. So I started saying to someone, I was like, what the fuck? Are you I'm trying to rip people off? That's a bigger scam ever, sweetheart. I said you would never go to any place Asian or anything and they'd never give you that for six pounds. Are you fucking dumb? They'll give you a big fucking jug of mango latte for that. Oh, it's Evil Queen's own coffee what, shop. Gotcha. So I started saying, oh, that's fucking Business ridiculous. Business woman. And then the woman starts arguing with me. I'm just saying to you that it's a scam, sweetheart. 
Do you agree with me or do you think that they should be selling Rubicon for six pounds a shot? That's the biggest scam. And then they made me a coffee and then I've looked at the coffee, it's like water. And I says, you've used semi-skim milk. We don't have full fat milk. I said, well, you don't know how to make a cappuccino then. Anyway, I'm not even gonna go into it. Rubicon. Could you imagine? Could you imagine if she went into a coffee shop that I was in? Do you know, I'm not going to lie. Can I just say, when when I go around um, central London, I am genuinely petrified. I am genuinely, from the bottom of my heart, petrified that I'm going to run into that. Honestly. Because I've... in. I don't know. And there's a couple of friends from London as well that I've spoken to about this. We have like roots or her voice ingrained in the back of our head. So just, we've got like an escape plan because you'd be surprised.